Forensic Photography Reviewer Al Hazen, IBN Al Haytham, a great authority on optics in the Middle Ages who lived around 1000 AD, invented the first pinhole camera. Also called the camera obscura and was able to explain why the images were upside down. Angelo Sala, a self-educated chemist, he discovered that when paper contained powdered silver nitrate it would react with sunlight, causing it to darken. These pioneering experiments with silver salts were a crucial step towards the later invention of photography. He published his findings in a pamphlet in 1614. Anna Atkins, 1799-1871, an English botanist, she is considered to be the first female photographer. Aristotle, he observed and noted the first casual reference to the Optic laws that made pinhole cameras possible, around 330 BC, he questioned why the sun could make a circular image when it shined through a square hole. Arthur Felig, Ouija, became famous because of his frequent, seemingly prescient arrivals at scenes only minutes after crimes. Fires or other emergencies were reported to authorities. Carl William Sheila, 1742 to 1786, Swedish scientist, self-educated. He used to work as an assistant in pharmacies and showed a talent in chemistry from a very young age. In spite an offer made to him to study in London or Berlin, he operated a pharmacy in Caping where he spent the rest of his life and made all his important inventions. He was especially interested on chemical analysis and worked particularly with the chemical reactions between silver nitrate and sunlight, therefore making a breakthrough in the chemistry of photography. The records from his experiments were of a great importance for the next generations of scientists. Digital photography uses an array of electronic photo detectors to capture the image focused by the lens, as opposed to an exposure on Photographic film. Emulsion, is a mixture of two or more liquids that are normally immiscible, non-mixable or unblendable. Emulsions are part of a more general class of two-phase systems of matter called colloids. Exposure, is the amount of light per unit area, the image plane. Illuminance times the exposure time, reaching a photographic film as determined by shutter speed, lens aperture, and scene luminance. Film speed, is the measure of a photographic film's sensitivity to light, determined by sensitometry and measured on various numerical scales, the most recent being the ISO system. Forensic photography, forensic imaging, crime scene photography. It is the art of producing an accurate reproduction of a crime scene or an accident seen using photography for the benefit of a court or to aid in an investigation. Frederick Scoff Archer, an English sculptor who invented the wet plate negative in 1851. Using a viscous solution of collodion, he coated glass with light-sensitive silver salts. Because it was glass and not paper, this wet plate created a more stable and detailed negative. Gelatin it is used to hold silver halide crystals in an emulsion in virtually all photographic films and photographic papers. George Eastman, he invented in 1889 a film with a base that was flexible, unbreakable, and could be rolled. Emulsions coated on a cellulose nitrate film base, such as Eastman's, made the mass-produced box camera a reality. Hamilton Smith he patented in 1856 the tintypes, another medium that heralded the birth of photography. A thin sheet of iron was used to provide a base for light-sensitive material, yielding a positive image. Tintypes are a variation of the collodion wet plate process. The emulsion is painted onto a japanned, varnished, iron plate, which is exposed in the camera. Heliographs, sun prints, were the prototype for the modern photograph. Henry Fox Talbot, 
an English botanist and mathematician and the inventor of the first negative from which multiple postive prints were made. Hercules Florence, 1804-1879, few details are known for his life. In 1824 goes to Brazil and takes part in a scientific mission at the Amazon, where he becomes preoccupied with the idea of recording images. From his trip, from 1830 devotes himself to research and experimentation for photography. The above, gives Brazil the ability to claim that is one of the places in the world, where photography was found. Hippolyte Bayard, 1807-1887, the most unfortunate from the pioneers of photography, discovered one direct positive photographic method. He was the first person to hold a photographic exhibition, for humanitarian reasons, and the first who combined two negatives to created one print, called combination printing. As a civil servant, and with 500 francs that received as financial help from Arago for improving his method, prevented him from presenting the discovery of photography at the French Academy of Sciences. History of Photography, Timeline Ancient times, camera obscuras used to form images on walls in darkened rooms, image formation via a pinhole. 16th century, brightness and clarity of camera obscuras improved by enlarging the hole inserting a telescope lens. 17th century, camera obscuras in frequent use by artists and made portable in the form of sedan chairs. 1727, Professor J. Schultz mixes chalk, nitric acid, and silver in a flask, notices darkening on side of flask exposed to sunlight. Accidental creation of the first photosensitive compound. 1800, Thomas Wedgwood makes sun pictures by placing opaque objects on leather treated with silver nitrate, resulting images deteriorated rapidly however, if displayed under light stronger than from candles. 1816, Nicephor Nieps combines the camera obscura with photosensitive paper. 1826, Nieps creates a permanent image. 1827, Joseph Nicephor Nieps made the first known photographic image using the camera obscura. The camera obscura was a tool used by artists to draw. 1834, Henry Fox Talbot creates permanent, negative, images using paper soaked in silver chloride and fixed with a salt solution. Talbot created positive images by contact printing onto another sheet of paper. 1837, Louis Daguerre creates images on silver-plated copper, coated with silver iodide and developed with warmed mercury, Daguerre is awarded a state pension by the French government in exchange for publication of methods and the rights by other French citizens to use the daguerreotype process. 1841, Talbot patents his process under the name Colotype. 1851, Frederick Scott Archer, a sculptor in London, improves Photographic resolution by spreading a mixture of collodion, nitrate cotton dissolved in ether and alcohol, and chemicals on sheets of glass. Wet plate collodion photography was much cheaper than daguerreotypes, the negative slash positive process permitted unlimited reproductions, and the process was published but not patented. 1853, Nader, Felix Tumacon, opens his portrait studio in Paris. 1854, Adolphe de Styri develops carte de visite photography in Paris, leading to worldwide boom in portrait studios for the next decade. 1855, beginning of stereoscopic era. 1855-57, direct positive images on glass, amber types, and metal. Tintypes or ferrotypes, popular in the U.S. 1861, 
Scottish physicist James Clerk Maxwell demonstrates a color photography system involving three black and white photographs, each taken through a red, green, or blue filter. The photos were turned into lantern slides and projected in registration with the same color filters. This is the color separation method. 1861 to 65, Matthew Brady and staff, mostly staff, covers the American Civil War, exposing 7,000 negatives. 1868, Dukas de Oran publishes a book proposing a variety of methods for color photography. 1870, center a period in which the U.S. Congress sent photographers out to the west. The most famous images were taken by William Jackson and Tim O'Sullivan. 1871, Richard Leach Maddox, an English doctor, proposes the use of an emulsion of gelatin and silver bromide on a glass plate, the dry plate process. 1877, Edward Mybridge, born in England as Edward Mugridge, Settles do a horse's four hooves ever leave the ground at once. Bet among rich San Franciscans by time sequenced photography of Leland Stanford's horse. 1878, dry plates being manufactured commercially. 1880, George Eastman, age 24, sets up Eastman Dry Plate Company in Rochester, New York. First halftone photograph appears in a daily. Newspaper, The New York Graphic. 1888, first Kodak camera, containing a 20-foot roll of paper, enough for 102.5-inch diameter circular pictures. 1889, improved Kodak camera with roll of film instead of paper. 1890, Jacob Rees publishes How the Other Half-Lives, images of Tenement Life in New York City. 1900, Kodak Brownie Box Roll Film Camera Introduced. 1902, Alfred Stieglitz Organizes Photo Secessionist Show in New York City. 1906, Availability of Panchromatic Black and White Film and Therefore High Quality Color Separation Color Photography. J.P. Morgan finances Edward Curtis to document the traditional culture of the North American Indian. 1907, first commercial color film, the autochrome plates. Manufactured by Lumiere Brothers in France. 1909, Louis Hine hired by U.S. National Child Labor Committee to photograph children working mills. 1914, Oscar Barnack. Employed by German microscope manufacturer Leitz. Develops camera using the modern 24x36mm frame and sprocketed 35mm. Movie film. 1917, Nippon Kagaku KK, which will eventually become Nikon. Established in Tokyo. 1921, Man Ray begins making photograms, rayographs, by placing. Objects on photographic paper and exposing the shadow cast by a distant light bulb, Yuga Grave, N.E. at Get, aged 64, assigned to photograph the brothels of Paris. 1924, Leitz markets a derivative of Barnack's camera commercially as the Leica, the first high-quality 35mm camera. 1925, André Cortez moves from his native Hungary to Paris, where he begins an 11-year project photographing street life. 1928, Albert Renger Patsch publishes The World is Beautiful. Close-ups emphasizing the form of natural and man-made objects. Rollet introduces the Roloflex twin lens reflex producing a 6x6. CM image on roll film, Carl Blosfeld publishes Art Forms in Nature. 1931, Development of strobe photography by Harold, Doc, Edgerton. At MIT. 1932, inception of Technicolor for movies, where three black and white negatives were made in the same camera under different filters. 
Ansel Adams, Imogen Cunningham, Willard Van Dyke, Edward Weston. Et al., Form Group F-64 dedicated to straight photographic thought. And production. Henry Cartier Bresson buys a Leica and begins a 60-year career photographing people, on March 14, George Eastman. Age 77, writes suicide note my work is done. Why wait? And shoots himself. 1933, Brassi publishes Paris Denude. 1934, Fuji Photo Film founded. By 1938, Fuji is making cameras and lenses in addition to film. 1935, Farm Security Administration hires Roy Stryker to run a historical section. Stryker would hire Walker Evans, Dorothea Lang, Arthur Rothstein, ETAL to photograph rural hardships over the next six years. Roman Vishniak begins his project of the soon-to-be-killed by their neighbors Jews of Central and Eastern Europe. 1936, development of Kodachrome, the first color multi-layered color. Film, development of Exacta, pioneering 35mm single lens reflex. SLR, camera. World War II, development of multi-layer color negative films. Margaret Bourke-White, Robert Kappa, Carl Maidans, and W. Eugene. Smith cover the War for Life magazine. 1940s, in the early 1940s commercially viable color films. Except Kodachrome, introduced in 1935, were brought to the market. These films used the modern technology of dicoupled colors in which a chemical process connects the three dye layers together to create an apparent color image. 1947, Henry Cartier-Bresson, Robert Kappa, and David Seymour start the photographer-owned Magnum Picture Agency. 1948, Hasselblad in Sweden offers its first medium-format SLR4. Commercial sale, Pentax in Japan introduces the automatic diaphragm. Polaroid sells instant black and white film. 1949, East German Zeiss develops the Conta S, first SLR with an unreversed image in a pentaprism viewfinder. 1955, Edward Steken Curate's family of men exhibit at New York's Museum of Modern Art. 1959, Nick and F introduced. 1960, Gary Winogrand begins photographing women on the streets of New York City. 1963, first color instant film developed by Polaroid, Instamatic. Released by Kodak, first purpose-built underwater introduced, the Nikonos. 1970, William Wegman begins photographing his Weimar honor, Man Ray. 1972, 110 format cameras introduced by Kodak with a 13x17mm frame. 1973, C41 color negative process introduced, replacing C22. 1975, Nicholas Nixon takes his first annual photograph of his wife and her sisters, the Brown sisters, Steve Sasson at Kodak Builds. The first working CCD-based digital still camera. 1976, first solo show of color photographs at the Museum of Modern Art, William Eggleston's Guide. 1977, Cindy Sherman begins work on untitled film stills, completed. In 1980, Jan Groover begins exploring kitchen utensils. 1978, Hiroshi Sujimoto begins work on seascapes. 1980, Elsa Dorfman begins making portraits with the 20x24 Polaroid. 1982, Sony demonstrates Mavica still video camera. 1983, Kodak introduces disc camera, using an 8x11mm frame, the same as in the Minox spy camera. 1985, Minolta markets the world's first autofocus SLR system, called Maxim in the US, in the American West by Richard Avedon. 1988, Sally Mann begins publishing nude photos of her children. 1987, 
the popular Canon EOS system introduced, with new all-electronic lens mount. 1990, Adobe Photoshop released. 1991, Kodak DCS100, first digital SLR, a modified Nikon F3. 1992, Kodak introduces Photo CD. 1993, founding of Photo.net, this website, an early internet online community, Sabas Tiao Salgado publishes workers, Mary Ellen Mark publishes book documenting life in an Indian circus. 1995, Material World, by Peter Menzel published. 1997, Rob Silvers publishes Photo Mosaics. 1999, Nikon D1 SLR, 2.74 megapixel for $6,000, first ground-up DSLR. Designed by a leading manufacturer. 2000, Camera Phone introduced in Japan by Sharp slash J Phone. 2001, Polaroid goes bankrupt. 2003, Fourth Earth Standard for Compact Digital SLRs introduced with the Olympus E1, Canon Digital Rebel introduced for less than $1,000. 2004, Kodak ceases production of film cameras. 2005, Canon EOS 5D, first consumer-priced full-frame digital SLR. With a 24x36mm CMO sensor for $3,000, portraits by Reint Dijkstra. Infrared photography, the film or image sensor used is sensitive to infrared light. Johann Heinrich Schultz, 1687-1744, he was a German professor at the University of Altdorf. He was the first person to produce photograms, which were created by using paper masks in direct contact with a jar containing a mixture of silver nitrate powder and chalk. Schultz proved that the darkening of silver nitrate was caused by light and ruled out the possibility of the change being caused by temperature by observing no tonal change to silver nitrate when heated in an oven. Joseph Nicephorn Yeps, made the first photographic image with a camera obscura. Latent image, is an invisible image produced by the exposure to light of a photosensitive material such as photographic film. Louis Daguerre, a Frenchman and a professional scene painter, was able to reduce exposure time to less than 30 minutes and keep the image from disappearing afterwards. He was the inventor of the first practical process of photography. Mugshot, police photograph, booking photograph, is a photographic portrait typically taken after a person is arrested. Negative, is an image, usually on a strip or sheet of transparent plastic film, in which the lightest areas of the photographed subject appear darkest and the darkest areas appear lightest. Parallax, is a displacement or difference in the apparent position of an object viewed along two different lines of sight, and is measured by the angle or semi-angle of inclination between those two lines. Photography, it is a method of recording images by the action of light or related radiation on a sensitive material. Photographic film, film, is a strip or sheet of transparent plastic. Film base coated on one side with a gelatin emulsion containing microscopically small light-sensitive silver halide crystals. Point-and-shoot camera, compact camera, is a still camera designed primarily for simple operation one most use focus-free lenses or autofocus for focusing, automatic systems for setting the exposure options, and have flash units built in. Rogues Gallery is a police collection of pictures or photographs of criminals and suspects kept for identification purposes. Shutter lag, is the delay between triggering the shutter and when the photograph is actually recorded. Shutter speed, exposure time, is the length of time a camera's shutter is open when taking a photograph. Silver halides, the light-sensitive chemicals used in photographic film and paper. Single lens reflex camera, SLR, 
typically uses a mirror and prism system, hence reflex, from the mirror's reflection, that permits the photographer to view through the lens and see exactly what will be captured, contrary to viewfinder cameras where the image could be significantly different from what will be captured. Sir Humphrey Davy, 1778-1829, chemistry genius, friend, and assistant of Wedgwood in his experiments whose results were published at Royal Society, in 1802 by Davy. The problem of fixing the images remained. In spite of Davy's breakthroughs in chemistry, Sir John F. W. Herschel, a scientist who first used the word photography in 1839. The word photography was derived from the Greek words photos, which means light and graphine, which means to draw. Snapshot, is popularly defined as a photograph that is shot spontaneously and quickly, most often without artistic or journalistic intent. Thomas Wedgwood, 1771-1805, an Englishman who made good ground, creating photograms and recording images from his camera obscura or pinhole camera, however, he never overcome the problem of fixing the image and therefore the prints produced had to be viewed for very short periods of time in a darkened environment. Twin lens reflex camera, TLR, is a type of camera with two objective lenses of the same focal length. Viewfinder, is what the photographer looks through to compose, and in many cases to focus, the picture.